welcome back guys so we are still here so what i'll do is i'll click on open event manager so it's going to load my event manager so we are going to install our conversion api so that is what we use to track um the iphone users event too so it's loading it now it's loading okay i'll just click on close i don't need it So I don't know why it's taking too long. Okay. As you can see, our event, our um our pixel is now active. It's ready to receive event. It's ready to receive event. So it's telling us to set up conversion API to help decrease cost per action. So I can click on get started here. I can click on get started here. I'll go to settings i'll go to settings then now you can see i have my business right and i have this asset right so if you have more than one asset you can add it to it just i will show you how to add more um add account so now you come to where you have conversion api and you click on this um set up manually you see where you have get started you click on generate token you click on generate token you can click on get started so um now but before we do this let's go to our plugins again we are going to install one more plugins so the plugin is called pixel your site pixel your site your site so pixel your site so now um this plugin does not work with the current version of the php well so let's we are going to use this one this pixel your site this is the one we are going to use then after we install it we are going to activate it so it's loading is loading i don't know why it's taking too long it's loading 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 then we click on activate so it is activated now it is activated now so if you go to this preserve your site you go to dashboard now you come back here you can close this close this we don't need it close it now what we want to do now is facebook we want to connect our facebook right so we want to connect our facebook so i'll click on click for settings enable this and enable this so after enabling the conversion api token and the event machine so we'll come here the facebook pixel that we copied earlier so that i copied right here i will copy it this is the Facebook pixel, the pixel code, that is the ID. I'll come here and paste it right here. So it remains our conversion API token. So I can go back to Facebook. Then I can see I want to, you can click on this get started. Get started. You click on next. So click on add to wish list, just choose um purchase. Um I think this three is okay. Yes, just choose that three. Or you choose any one of your choice, then you click on next. So after clicking on next, um now so we need to set up the um additional parameter. So we choose this um now you come down here you choose you can choose anything just choose like two or three is fine so you choose this you can choose this you can choose this you choose this you click on this you choose this you can choose this choose this choose this just choose a random then you come to this third one you can do the same thing
<coughs> so you can do the same thing for this one you can do the same thing just choose any one of your choice choose and choose then after doing all this so best practices so i can just choose event id so it's not a must to just choose everything then you click on continue then you click on continue then you click on finished so after clicking on finish let's go back to our settings let's go to this place so what you click on now is generate access token so you click on generate access token then you copy this so you copy this after copy it you go to your website now you paste the api token here you paste it here then after that you come back here to test event so that is the event key so you copy this one you copy this event key then you come back to your website and paste it right here so after that you go down here you go down you go down you go you scroll down and you click on save setting so that is how to set up your conversion api so once you just get here just click on this refresh your pay refresh your event manager now you see our website is ready to roll our website is ready to roll you need it to you just mark as complete so it's completed so now we now have you see is now in, in progress so right now we can create our event we can create our event our conversion api is actually ready now we can create our event 